good. I have been to the birthplace of Marcus Garvey, but I cannot leave this country without visiting the resting place or the final resting place of Marcus Moser Garvey. So I'm here to pay my respect, like I always do. The feet always have to touch the ground, no matter what. captain who wanted to reverse the transatlantic even though he never lived to fulfill that but believe me or not Gavi still lives on and whatever teachings that he did or left on planet Earth, his legacy will forever live on and someday someone will be inspired by Gavi and reverse transatlantic we're gonna take Africans back to the motherland I'm not telling you to come and stay but let your feet touch the motherland it's exciting to see that his final resting place is made of the black star I don't know if you know the meaning of the black star is the hope for Africa he established the Black Star Line, which currently in Ghana, we're known for the Black Stars of Ghana. Marcus Gavi inspired many, inspired Kwame Nkrumah, inspired um, Martin Luther King. Like, almost everyone was inspired by this man right here. I mean, I, I hate to call him a legend. I would love to call him a demigod, if you all will permit me, because I feel like he deserves it. So... If you don't know, now you know. This is where Marcus Garvey was buried. But this was not his initial place that he was buried, right? He was buried in the UK, in London, where he passed on. And in which year did they bring him back? 1964. That's when he became our first national hero. We never had a national hero before. Now we have seven, but he was the first. And will always be the first. As it says right there on the tombstone. To make us first national, national hero. hero. And he saw continue. You know, of course, as President General of the UNIA, we titled him the Honorable. But when you are given the order of national hero, your title becomes the right excellent. So if you see on the money or on the old coins of Garvey, you always see them write his name as the right excellent Marcus Garvey. And that signifies that he's been awarded the order of the national hero of Jamaica. Where we are is the, is it a hero square or a hero park? They call this national hero square. National hero square. So Garvey is buried to the left of the monument that was set up to recognize Nani, who is our only female national yeah. heroine, right? Or female national hero, the only national heroine. Um, and that monument is uh, at the top, you see the Aben yeah? of the Maroons. You call it Aben too? We call it Aben. In Ghana, we also call it Aben? Yes, because it's, they, they were from that same place. What do you mean, we also? It's the same people. Exactly. Okay. That's a, that, that, the only difference is we learned how to eat the aki. We'll come and teach you guys soon. <laughs> it's poisonous. Don't eat it. <laughs> so, that's the, where Marcus Garvey was buried. Right in here.